We welcome those of you that were watching Duke's win over Wake Forest to Colonial Life Arena in Columbia. Matchup in the SEC East between 12th ranked Kentucky and the Gamecocks of South Carolina who come in having won four of their last five. Kentucky has lost two of its last four. And they'll probably lose their 12th ranking as well should they lose this game tonight. Brandon Knight's got the first four points of the ball game for the Wildcats. Boy, good. Mulgrove's going to get three or four blocks of the ball game. The important thing is to go at him. And they just. Wow! Him. I'd say that's going at him. Knight with Ellington on him. Looks for a pick. And now Jones on a blow by as Muldrow bit on the screen. Shot blocker, but then the very next possession, Muldrow doesn't sit on his left. They're on the floor most of the time. Wide open look for Miller. Got it. Wasn't that good action? That was very good action. Harrelson with the on ball handoff. Almost like getting it to the fullback possession, Brad. Look at Harrelson. That's just a handoff by a big. They do it a lot at the mid-post area. And then Lamb turns down what would have been a tough. Gamecocks turn it over. Lamb for three. They keep it alive underneath. And Brandon Knight scores. Trying to get the rebound, but Jones comes out of the pack with it. There it's Jones. Nice crossover. Oh, throw down by Jones. Don't. I don't want to know what the top ten plays of the day are, but I know not what number one. And he almost threw it away again. Muldrow blocked by Harrelson. And Kentucky's got it back. Harrelson running the other way. Big play by Harrelson on both ends. Active in this ball game. Running down 50-50 balls. He gets out in front of the pack. Lucky they didn't get called for a hang on the rim. because Jones asking for it down there with R.J. Slauson guarding him now, but they'll take the outside three instead. Brandon Knight. In fact, this is a 5-0 push by South Carolina to get back in the game. Almost blocked another yeah. shot, but Miller stayed with it underneath. I found him right now. That's a big mismatch in height, but Smith's a tough guy. They finally got it down low. It's just a matter of time before the mismatch was going to show up, and Jones has another dunk. Cut by DeAndre Liggins and watch Terrence Jones as he comes down. Yeah, watch the landing right there yeah, on oh, the ball. ball. Got him. Well, when you, when you dunk like he does and you throw the ball down through the net. Paulson having trouble getting it in. Got it. Miller with the shot clock expiring. Got it. That's a big, big turn of events right there. South Carolina should have done no worse than go to the locker room down eight. Could have been even better. Instead, Kentucky comes down with 2.8, gets Darius Miller a good look. He knocks down the mid-range jumper, and it's, again, a 10-point advantage. Oh, that's a big play in this game. And that's Miller, and he's fouled and won. And that was Richardson that fouled him. Driving the ball to the nail. Look at Miller. Takes it right almost across the nail where you line up your toe for a free throw. And that's either crashing the boards to get those or being in the right place at the right time. Knight scores again. 13 for Brandon Knight. With Ellington in foul trouble. South Carolina throws a zone at Kentucky, and that's not easy to do. Darius Miller having a good yeah. ball game. It's not easy to zone Kentucky, Brad, because you have to respect the three-point ability. And when you do, gap attacks are... ...is it away. And Knight's going to try to go one-on-one -on -one with Galloway to the rack. But he leaves it for his trail man. And it's Terrence Jones. And South Carolina's got to take a timeout. Things are starting to slip away on their home floor. As his man, Brandon Knight... Knew where he was at the right time for his 12 points of the game. Miller with a floater. He's playing very well. He sure is. A guy that cannot disappear for Kentucky. Big Sam. Miller again in the lane. And Darius Miller is leading the way for Kentucky right now to take it from 20 feet away to get a clean two-point look. And now Jones and Lamb run together, and Lamb with a lay oh, they're, they're not scrambling Kentucky at all. Kentucky's scrambling. Oh. Jones rolls off a pick. Knight puts up a three and nails it. 20.
force Brandon Knight to his left defensively here, and he does, but he goes all the way around the wow. pick and lays it in. A half-court defense non-existent by South Carolina in this game. And many opportunities for Darren Horn in the film session tonight, tomorrow, whenever he wants to have it, have it both times to break down what we did not. Well, Brandon Knight's is going to work off of an on-ball screen action here. Turns the corner. Look at Ellington because he has four fouls, can't get involved. Well, three-possession game, and South Carolina's got a hustle. And now another rejection by Jones of Ellington, this time in close. And Terrence Jones has played a man game today. I ran into Terrence. So now South Carolina will back away. They'll see their record fall to 12 and 6 and 3 and 2 in conference play in Kentucky. Big win on the road to stay in that upper echelon of the SEC East as they will go to 15 and 4 and likewise 3 and 2 in the Eastern Division of the Southeastern Conference with a 67 to 58 win. Brandon Knight led the way as three Kentucky Wildcats were in double figures, led by Brandon Knight with 23. Final score, Kentucky 67, South Carolina 58. That's going to do it for us.